Uh, Towson, obviously, always a, a tough team to play against for you guys. What was the difference today that made you able to pull it out? Um, I think we just came out with an uh, attitude, you know. I know we know these guys are mad that we beat them at their house, and I know we know that they want to come in here and play hard, and especially coming off what happened last season in the tournament and just all just stuff boiling up over from that. So we just want to come out and just play with attitude, play hard, and especially play play for Devon today. How long does it feel like to get ball swinging you on a three-point? How long does it feel like to get ball swinging you on a three-point? Forever. <laughs> uh, but you know, I'm glad it went in. That's just the. The teamwork we had, the chemistry we, we built over the year and over the year, and we just, I was just happy it went in. So. How long did you like? Were you nervous at all about the review? Because it didn't seem like you should have been, but you had to wait. Oh yeah, I was nervous because I got that <laughs> same call at Charleston and they took it away. So you know, I was just happy it went in. In your case, um, it, was, it seems like a small play because you never know what a double technical does. It's like the biggest act of like passive aggression ever. Like, but when you got it. It's a spark play, and you you stare the kid down. Like I mean, and then you guys go on that run, you stretch your lead out to ten. But you had the two spots. What happened in that sequence? And then was there a point where you were like, all right, I'm, I'm trying to give my team a jump? Or Just when we came out the second half, we knew we had to pick it up. So this decided to give it everything we got. I mean. <coughs> Go get both of them. That's a big momentum play. I mean, even though we got the tech that brought us that carried everyone, got everyone going. So that's how it is. For you, I mean, like, does that sequence for you? I mean, it's two blocks and a double technical. That's kind of a cool thing to happen in, like, a five-second window. Like, was, was that a jump at all? Oh, yeah, that got me going, especially <laughs> especially seeing the crowd hyped up, coaches hyped up, just everyone happy for each other. And, and that really, uh, that play or that sequence really turned it over for us. Like, let's go. Like, let's do this. Like, what was the first half, second half? Because obviously, I mean, Numbers and numbers, you shot the ball well, just turned the ball over. Yeah. The second half, you locked down on defense and took care of the ball. You were comfortable the rest of the way. So. Like you said, defense, uh, you know, for me, I know my role on this team, like I said before in many interviews, but it's just going out there and playing hard on their best player and just making it hard for them. And I think everyone else on the team just feeds off from that. And um, I just try to do my best, play hard, and I hope my teammates are inspired from my play, and I think that's what gets them going. Are you on the spot chain? I mean, like, game back to Austin, one game left, one minute to You guys are in a good spot. Um, I think uh, we're in a good spot, but you know, Saturday is no just walk in and walk out type of game. We still want to get better, especially uh, going into next week. And uh, we know in the tournament, uh, even after one game for me, I know in the tournament that regular season really, it matters, but it doesn't matter. We still want to go in there and play hard and any team could get going that day. And we want to be the team to play hard and get, and get going, so. Uh, going into Saturday, I mean, it's a big game, but Whatever happens, happens. Hopefully, you come up with a win. And then, just once the tournament comes, it doesn't matter what your record is. Everyone's out there. It's one and done. Play, go big, go home. So, we're just going to go lay it out there and hopefully get what we want. And Sean, how good did it feel today to you know be able to connect from the floor? And some past few games have been a little tough from the floor for you, but just to be able to get going offensively. Uh, it was it was cool, but you know, I hang my head off on playing defense. Uh, just it was a uh, it was cool to see the ball going a couple of times you know as you said I have a, I had had a stretch of a, a couple of bad games but that's just my teammates picking me up Vasa talking to me Devon talking to me all my teammates just talking to me and um, that, I, I, I give it all to them and give them the credit and the man above obviously but yeah it was cool to see the ball going a couple of times and when you're tasked with locking down a guy like St Martin like does that sort of you know help you heighten your play on the other end as well sort of get you going locked in a little more oh yeah uh, I mean I just try to make it hard for him especially, uh, and I think just feeding off of that, I love competition. I, I love that matchup when I'm going against the best player on the other team. So that just juiced me up even more on the offensive end, just get it going and flow out there.